Hi guys and welcome back to episode 4 of the FM20 beta save with Liverpool. Apologies again, camera's playing up. Don't know what's wrong with it, but you guys win on that regard anyway. I've already got the game ready to start, so I'll quickly show you the results and stuff. I've kept it on the wrong screen, so you've probably just seen the <laughs> table, unless I remember to block it. But yeah, so since we were last here, we absolutely killed Chelsea 6-1, didn't we? So since then, it's been really good. We smashed Aston Villa away 5-3, Fabinho with a penalty, Henderson getting a brace, Sadio Mane and Shakiri getting one. They were 1-0 up very early on, I thought that was going to be one of those games, but it turned out to be a pretty good one. We then played Valencia at home, I was expecting a win to be fair, but didn't expect it to be this good. Henderson again scoring because he can't stop scoring for some reason. Chambo, Firmino and Gomez rounding it off. Clean sheet as well to help us on. Allison's found his way back into the team as well after that horrible injury which he did sustain in real life. But he's back and he's keeping us clean sheets. Then the next game, which is arguably better than the Chelsea game, although Chelsea are a better team, 7-0 against Sheffield United. I don't know what's going on here, but even again Allison getting a 7.2 rating. Trent getting a goal early on basically gave us the footing that we needed. Chambo getting a goal, Ronaldo getting a hat trick, Sadio Mane and Firmino, no Henderson for once. Then we last played Leicester in the Cup, in the EFL Cup, and weirdly a low scoring game. Clean sheet again though, which is nice, that's three clean sheets in a row. And it's a bit of a more realistic score, I suppose, so Firmino getting the one on that. So today we're going to play Man City. They are base, they are third, but they're joint second on points with a weird team, as you hopefully haven't seen. Unless I, again, forgot to block it up. But yeah, uh, then we're going to play Valencia after in the Champions League as well. I'll show the table quickly. We are top of the league by three points as well as it stands. Weirdly, Palace are the team that's doing really well. Although Zaha, though, insane. Let me have a quick uh, search of him. Where is he? He's been rated 90, like recommended of 92 by my scouts. As a winger for what we play, he's pretty good. Composure and long shots are a bit bad. But uh, as a forward, I think he's pretty decent as well. He's pressing forward like we do. He's, he's, there's a couple of bits here and there. I think he's overrated. As in, I don't think the scout's got that right. But he's, he's still very good. But he is banging him in for him. He's about 57 million. And he's doing very well this season. He could be a, could become a threat. But we'll get straight into the game. So we're about to start the game anyway. Trying to teams go out and prove a point. Yeah, I, I agree with that. Players agree with that. That's all good. Hopefully we can get ourselves a good result. As City are the main challengers. And we're on really good form. We are, in fact, the only, as it stands, unbeaten team in the Premier League as well. With a goal difference of 35, that's easily more than what points we have. Scored 44 goals in 11 games. And that is just the league, not including the thrashings we've been given in the Champions League as well. That's what we got the first highlight, possibly, although City are on the counter now with Silver. Got plenty of space. Gomez went flying in, missed it, and he's greedy. Good save in the end though by Allison. It's cleared. Now maybe we can start a counter if this is still a highlight. He's done his man. Not got much support though. And that's that attack fizzled out. Promising start to the game. First half hour has been pretty decent. Oh no, Sterling's always going to win that at his pace. Good pressure, put some more on, you're giving players too much space now. De Bruyne, Bernardo Silva. I'm not sure if that's meant to be a cross or a shot. Gone too far either way. Can have to keep an eye on Fabinho now as well, he's on a card. I'd say City are the team more in control as it stands. Still quite an even game though. They do have home advantage obviously. Oh, Aguero's done a great run. Great save by Alisson. I've noticed the one on ones are easier now. Like, keepers do tend to save them a lot more. Some might argue it's a bit too hard to score one on ones now. Thought that went in for a second then.
Chamberlain whips in a corner for Mino and it's in. Get in. 15th goal of the season for Bobby Firmino. Just on the cusp of half time as well. That is going to change our team talk. Can be a little bit more lax. Still a long way to go. Edison probably should have done better. But yeah, I'd probably say not against a run of play. Apart from possession, we are playing them, to, you know, going toe to toe with them. Do we say challenge still and go prove a point? Because I think it might be a bit much saying, oh, you know, you're doing really well. It's only half time you're away. We'll play it safe. We'll go with what our assistant goes with. It's worked quite well as well. As it stands, guys, we are going to be six points clear. Although I think I just see United a game in hand to us. Yeah, they are. They can go to 27 points. So we can go four points clear after this if they win their game in hand. Still very early, obviously. I think I'm going to take Fabinho off. He's not playing especially well anyway. Good play. Robertson needs to whip it and he's gone back for Milner though. Henderson nearly loses it, but well done. Keeps it. Ends up back with Robertson. We're getting pushed back now. We need to do something, guys. Oh, Milner's lost the ball. And this is going to be a bad decision for a sub. De Bruyne's done another guy. Does it push him out wide? Good interception. Chamber gets the first. Now we're on the attack now. Chamber's done his man's one-on-one -on -one with the keeper. Good save. Run a bit too far, I think, there. Too, too close to the goalkeeper. Robertson. Is he going to use his man? Nice try. Challenge and off. Nah, come on, ref. What? That's a great challenge. Okay, now this is going to be a problem. Got 25 minutes left. And we are a man down. I'm going to take... I feel like as we're winning, we don't need a striker. I know it will leave us very basically defending most of the game. But I do feel that's probably the best option. I won't bring however on. I'll bring Gomez out on the way, um, right side and bring Matip on. We need more experience. Hopefully, we've got enough in us to stay in control. City with a corner. Oh, is that a penalty? I don't think it is. Oh, no, it's come back for the VAR. It's going to be a penalty. It is. It's a penalty. I mean, I didn't see it properly. I just see their player go flying. Henderson, of all people. Easy penalty for Aguero. 1-0. Not ideal, guys. But a 1-0 draw away at City will be still considered a good result. Just annoying to think if we hadn't got a man down. We might have won it. I mean, there's still 15 minutes left. But without a striker, I can't see us really making a difference here. Oh, sloppy play. Come on, you're a striker down. Nowhere else. I think I'm going to have to tell him to concentrate a bit. Well done, Milner. Good challenge. Chambers done his man. He's on the run. He's all on his own. Keep going, son. Lovely cross. I didn't realise he was open. And man, he's missed an absolute sitter. Oh, we should be winning now. Will they verge you? Getting unlucky here, guys. Two really good chances there. The first one, Mane would never miss that. Well, he would, to be fair, but very rarely. Good challenge. Cracker of a ball if he's onside, which I think he is. Cannot hit the target, though. Um, I've absolutely messed that amount. How can we change this around, really? I think... Do we bring on... See, Robinson's not having a great game. Let's try it. Let's try the kid. <clears throat> Excuse me. Hopefully I don't regret that. But Robinson's not playing too great. Five minutes left. 
I feel like there's another goal in this game. Well done, whoever. Marnie's got no support, really, that I can see. But Chambo's done a great run here. Can he score it this time? He has. He's done it. Five minutes to go. Alex Oxlade-Chamberlain is the hero. Fifth goal of the season. And we may, may have just done enough to beat Man City away a man down for most of the second half. He was had no pressure of the player, to be fair. Good finish. Van Dijk is starting to breathe out of his arse now. That's the problem. Probably going to have to rest them soon. Random way to start the highlight. Hendo smashing in. I think that was the highlight. Game's not over yet by the looks of it. Oh, Gomez. Aguero. Push him out, push him out. Oh, no, he's done his man. Good save. And again. Oh. Odson Edward, ex Ch um, Chelsea Celtic. I think they've signed him. Don't know how much they would have paid, but he's basically just had a sitter there. It's not ideal, but. Could this really be a chance now? Mere seconds left of the game. No, I don't think so. He's Mane, that's it. Dink it, dink it. How have people got in the box? I know we haven't got a striker. All right, ref, just blow now. <laughs> Ten seconds left. Edward's through. Good save, Allison And Matip's there to clear up the rebound just in time. Crack a game, though. I'm quite happy with that result, uh, bleh, result overall. But it's just unfortunate. I feel like if Trent didn't get himself sent off, which I thought was a good challenge, we could have maybe stuck out the win. It's still not over, to be fair. It should have gone over a minute ago, nearly. It has ended now. Two will draw. Yeah, we're sympathised because that was a really good game. Played well. Man down for most of the second half. So, let's have a look. So I can appeal it if I want. He does think it's justified. See, I want to... I'm going to appeal it because I feel that was a good challenge. Got to pay £500,000. Alex Oxlade-Chamberlain had an amazing game. Two chairs there for Fabinho. You can go away. 11 games unbeaten for us now. And uh, we'll come back in a second, guys, for the game against Valencia. Two things to note before we play the next game. Trent's ban was upheld, which is fair enough. I mean, I disagree it was a foul, but it was always an ask to do that. And then secondly, we've had news on the Brexit in-game. And it looks like we're possibly going to be dealing with work permits in the future for anyone in... Europe, so it, that's going to be a bit annoying if they're not in a high enough league, or if the country rank is not high enough, not play enough games, and all that sort of thing. We might miss out on playing with some good players, but generally, it shouldn't be a problem for the sort of players we would be going for. But it is at least it's not the 15 foreign player limit one, which is very annoying for anyone that's suffered through that one. Good news is Salah's back, they reckon he could play 75 minutes. Same with Marnie, although a few players need a rest apparently. I do agree with Van Dijk, although it is against Valencia away. What I'll do though is I'll play Matip for the game. And we could always bring Van Dijk on if it's a bit iffy. Some players are getting to, like, um, Gigi's getting to the bit where I'd probably start giving him a rest. Same with Trent. But they're fine for now. I don't. You don't always have to go on the rest icon. It's just more advice. But that's my general rule of thumb. 80 or lower is when I tend to change him around a bit. Challenge will go out and prove a point. Again, away at Valencia, we're doing well. Yeah, I agree with that. It's hard to decide what is the best team talk at the moment. Because we are getting the odd scabby result, the odd draw here and there. But at least our last one was against Man City, so as I expected. What a ball, straight away, five minutes in. We've got ourselves a penalty, boys. Although it is going to VAR. I'm not sure if they check them all in Europe as well as they do in the Prem. Fabinho to take. 
not the best penalty. Keeper was very close, but goal nonetheless. His fourth goal of the season. It's a good start. Hopefully, that's what we need to go on. So, four games in so far, as it stands, we're four points clear at the top. If we can win this game, we uh, give ourselves a bit of breathing space. Trent at the moment is on it. Henderson on to Salah, back to Trent. He's going to whip it in, he does. It's cleared, only as far as Fabinho though. Gaia clears it to Kanging. Caught us on the break, good here. But Matip does his job and pressures him off. Not much going on at the moment. 12 minutes in, they've had two shots, we've had one. Ours is the only on target and it's gone in. And it was a penalty. If penalty shit. I don't know if penalties count as like shots and shots on target. They should do. Paragio for Valencia. Ambitious ball. Apologies for the lag. It's not on my game. I can see it on the recording software. I have put the graphics on medium, so it's definitely not um, my game. I mean, my game can power like I know it's not the best graphics game in the world, but I can play the Outer Worlds on 4K on you know Ultra and everything, and there's not an issue. So I think it's because it's a beta. It's munching up on all the CPU and RAM and all that crap. I'm not the best. I'm not the most computer knowledgeable. So hopefully it's just the beta. I don't know if anyone else is getting the issue though. I've watched a couple of YouTubers and theirs don't seem to be this bad. But hopefully when the game is out properly that will be dealt with. I've noticed since they did the hotfix, I think it was yesterday they did a hotfix and there was three things changed. I've noticed that's when I've had the issue. I've not had the issue before that. I was playing on the high graphics and everything before that. Prima point, yeah, no need to change it around. It's good for morale. We're away as well, and we've only scored due to a penalty. Although we are, if we can hit the target, we'd be playing quite well. A couple of their players are disenchanted. Robertson intercepts and gives it to Mane. Henderson out to Trent. Fabs knocks it back out to Trent. Good ball. Can he get it in? Nips it to Salah. Open goal to Firmino. And it's in. 16th goal of the season for him. Still, the game is not over. It's a long way to go. We're only just 10 minutes into the second half. But we have got that nice little cushion now. Well worked piece of play. Literally left yourself with an open goal to score as well. Decent ball to Guedes. And he just skims it wide. Hopefully the keeper would have had it covered anyway. Going to take... I think we'll take both of these off to be fair. Oh, I don't want to bring... Don't really want to bring... Tell you what. I'll bring Milner on because he can do the job. I don't want to bring Van Dyke on. The whole point of him not playing is to rest. Oh, lovely interception there and change of direction. Oh, shame he couldn't get a goal. Good shot though, good save. Got ourselves a corner. Gomez picks up the loose ball. Oh, we're now five points clear. Shakta must be beating um, Leipzig. Matip heads it clear as far as Guedes. Gives it to Mangala. Garay, Kong Dogbia. Not great defending there. Didn't even look like Matip jumped. 
I've mean, got myself booked lovely jubbly. We've got some bad fitness going on here, guys. Gonna have to rest some players soon, I think. I'm not really one to rotate. I like keeping my team all the same, but with the amount of competitions we're in this year, kind of got no choice. Oh, that was an awful pass by Henderson there. Getting our players back though. Looks like they're trying to tackle each other, mind. Go on, pick up Lisbell. Run a bit too far. Where's all the players on the pitch? There's like no one around. Good anticipation by whoever then to run back and carry on. Really don't know whose highlight this is. It seems to be going back and forth at the moment. Looks like it's going to be Valencia though. Block shot. I wouldn't have called that a key highlight to be fair. And that's it guys. Really comfortable victory there against Valencia. Morale must be really good at the moment because we're still unbeaten as well. 2.4 million given to us. Been had a good game. Tights is now here. So that's how it's pronounced. I'm not sure how to pronounce it. He's looking at a lot of people. Isn't that the player who used to play for Arsenal? Am I thinking right? Yeah, it is, yeah. Forgot how many years he'd been there, to be fair. But yeah, that's the episode, guys. I'll go ahead and play a bit of a chunk on anyway. Still really won the Champions League. Not sure when exactly I'll come back, but we might try and get a bit done. We'll see if we can get at least two seasons done. Maybe more in beta. But yeah, I hope you liked it guys. If you did, hit that like button please. Any suggestions, feel free to give me in the comments because I'm still relatively new to YouTube. I've only been doing it since May. Sorry for the stuttering in the video. Again, I think it's the game because I don't get any issues with anything else I record. And I didn't have an issue before the update, the hotfix. But yeah, subscribe if you're new and I'll see you next time. Bye for now.